So we are less than eight days away from the biggest Yeezy drop of the year. And as the mysterious countdown timer continues to expire on Yeezy supply as promised, I will be giving you guys updates for Yeezy Day 2021. So Adidas has a top secret release plan releasing exclusively for Yeezy Day 2021. We have the Yeezy 700 V3 Dark Glow. Stay tuned guys, video's coming right up next y'all. What's up? Appreciate everybody for tuning in for today's new video. If you guys haven't done so, make sure y'all are subscribed to the channel. That way you can stay up to date on all of the information that applies as the Easy Day 2021 slowly approaches us. So, so many questions and not a lot of answers. As you guys know, Adidas is keeping things top secret for what's planned for Yeezy Day 2021. The only thing that has been confirmed so far is that there are several releases planned to release on August 2nd, which means we're not sure how the release will go down, whether it will be via confirmed, whether it will be via Yeezy supply. Original rumors were reporting that Yeezy Day would be available as a worldwide release, so we will have to wait and see how that goes down. Now, a few things have changed, which leads me to speculate a few different things. So first and foremost, on my release schedule for the US, not included, I do not see the orange 700 MMVN, and I do not see the 350 V2 taillight. So it could either be that those two sneakers were just rumors and they are not dropping, or a very interesting thing that could be going down is that Yeezy Day will have regional exclusive drops. So we could see certain drops go down in one region and be excluded from other regions of the world. So as of right now, the confirmed drops that we have for the US release schedule on Yeezy Day are the 700 V1 Wave Runner, the 350 V2 Reflective Synth, the 350 V2 Reflective Cloud White, the 350 V2 Black Static, the 350 V2 Zebra, the Black 700 MNVN, and a surprise release that no one saw coming, the Yeezy 700 V3 Dark Glow. So I don't have any other details on the next 700 V3 release other than the colorway, but I can speculate based off the color wheel that we always reference for Yeezy releases, there are two Yeezy colorways that draw my interest when referring to the 700 V3 Dark Glow. So one being a colorway that looks similar to the original 700 V3 samples. This one has a lighter tone, similar to the Azale. And then you have a darker tone Yeezy 700 V3. This one kind of gives me vibes of the Alba as you have more darker tones going on throughout this silhouette. Now, an another interesting fact is that the TPU cage, which is used on the upper outside of the V3, every colorway released so far has had that glow effect. So what would be the difference and why would Yeezy name these joints specifically the 700 V3 Dark Glow? Could it be that these have more glow material? For example, maybe the entire upper glows, possibly the sole on these joints glow. I'm not sure what to expect for right now, but salute to our guy Influence Visions for providing this mock-up photo of what the glow feature could look like. So let me know guys, are y'all excited for this surprise Yeezy Day release? We have the 700 V3 Dark Glow coming soon. So due to real world conditions, shipping delays across the industry are delaying sneaker releases. So the Yeezy Foam Runner, Ochre, as well as MX, Cream Clay, which I reported originally would be dropping July 24th, unofficially have now been delayed. So it's looking like they could possibly drop now as a part of the Yeezy Day releases, but no word has been confirmed, so we will have to stay tuned for that drop, guys. All we know as of right now is the cream clays will be dropping in full family sizing to very limited stock. The Oka colorway will be dropping in adults only and will have a larger stock than any foam runner colorway ever released. But don't get too excited. As you guys know, the demand for the Yeezy foam runner is at an all time high, one of the most high in demand footwear models on the market so pairs will still be tough to cop. So let me know which colorway are you guys feeling a little more, the ochre or the cream clay with that nice MX colorway. 
So I don't know what to think. Adidas is being top secret about Yeezy Day. All we know is it is gonna be the biggest drop of the year and it's scheduled currently to release on August 2nd. So we don't know if all pairs are gonna drop all at once, if they're gonna drop on confirmed, or if they're gonna do it like the first Yeezy Day where they have scheduled releases periodically throughout the day. All is up in the air, but I wanna let you guys know that as any information that I get I'm gonna let you guys know immediately and make sure that we are all up to date to have the best chance to cop some of these dope releases for Yeezy Day. So salute guys, make sure y'all are subbed up to the channel, drop a like and comment on this video. I'm JA, stay safe, stay blessed. I'm out y'all.